Hi, my name is Joe Burning and I am the Social Studies TSA. I'm here to tell you about a strategy that is really useful in social studies classes. You may have heard of it before, it's called the RAFT strategy. And that stands for Role, Audience, Format, and Topic. If you'll notice, with this strategy, it gives students an opportunity to really break down the content from various perspectives. If you notice the role, the question is, what is the writer's role? Critic, eyewitness, staunch defender, reporter, etc. You'll see with the audience, who will read this writing? The teacher, other students, parents, community members, and so forth. If you look at the format of the activity, you will see that the question is, what is the best format for the writing? A poem, essay, letter, diary, newspaper, or article? And of course the topic is, the question is, who or what is the subject of the writing? Let's go ahead and take a few uh, looks at an example here. We'll see with social studies, for instance in a civics class, you could take on the role, or have students take on the role, of being a reporter for the British newspaper. Of course, they have to write an article as to an audience who would be newspaper readers in England during the 1770s. As I said before, it would be a newspaper article, and the topic is Boston Tea Party. As you can see, in having students respond to a writing in this format, it allows for them to consider varying perspectives. If you move to an example here with 21st century woman, students would take on the role of being a 21st century woman. Of course, they would be writing to Susan B. Anthony. They are writing a thank you note. And of course, the topic would be women's rights. Again, for social studies, it's an awesome strategy because it allows students to gain an understanding and scope of various perspectives.